The fear of a racing history made for a packed room in the McIntosh County courtroom where the county commission held their work session before tomorrow's meeting. A conversation surrounding future development on Sapelo Island that locals of the island are saying would destroy the culture of the island. Lindsay Stanger joins us from the newsroom. Lindsay, you were at the second meeting surrounding this proposed ordinance. Where does the commission stand? Simone, just like you said, this is the second meeting surrounding the proposed changes that would allow bigger homes on the island, which are bigger than the ones that are currently there. And at last week's zoning board meeting, the changes to lower to allow the size of homes to be built, as well as remove any talk of golf courses being added and was here tonight. Now, WTOC was not allowed to be in the meeting for the second time, but those in attendance had this to say. So if we continue to allow people to progress and make, you know, moves without involving the locals that's there, eventually the culture will be wiped out. Locals and island visitors lined the courtroom as the McIntosh County Commission discussed the future of Sapelo Island. A proposed ordinance that would allow homes to be built over double the size of what is currently on the island. You allow this expansion of the houses, it's going to destroy Hog Hammond. Linda Grabbit and her husband have been visiting the island for years, and they say the culture is what keeps bringing them back. We love it. We would never consider changing it. We love it as it is. A culture that the Gullah Geechee descendants are trying desperately to hold on to. Just because you have the money, the thing is, you don't care about our souls. But I also feel like the locals or the descendants of Sapelo Island have to keep standing firm on what they believe in, which is protecting the culture, protecting the island. According to Commissioner Roger Lawston, he believes that the county is trying to find a compromise by already lowering the size of the original 6,000 square feet to 3,000 square feet. But he hopes that the commission will take time to consider the locals. I feel good that they heard enough to cause them to think before they cast the vote. When I walked in the building today, I was pretty sure that if the vote was held today, that uh, I would have lost. But the future of the island could be determined tomorrow. The key thing tomorrow, we will either take a vote to, to postpone it or we'll take a vote on the, on the ordinance. Tomorrow's meeting will be held in the McIntosh County Government Office at 5 p.m. Simone.